Hello and welcome. My name is Aisha and I'll be walking you through this short video. I've always said that the difference between being dressed and well dressed is your accessories. So for that reason, in addition to many others, the name of this series was called Going From Dressed to Well Dressed, Nine Accessories Every Woman Should Own. This is the last video in the series, so hopefully you've caught the previous eight videos. Um, and as you can see, the premise of this video series has been that we are collecting our accessory merit badges. Um, and so this video also has a handout that goes along with it, so you want to look at the link at the bottom of the video. So you can print it out, check off the items that you have, check off the items that you still need to get, and you can just fold it up and take it with you when you go shopping. So we're going to take a look at the last item, which is the purse. So of course if you are just trying to be dressed, you would basically try to use the same purse for every occasion. However, we know that there are different life occasions where you may need to be a little bit more dressed up than usual. Um, so usually all women have, I call it just the work purse, the everyday purse that you take with you to work, to run errands, to do everything that you need to do. Um, and most of us don't really choose the stylish option. We're mostly looking for utility instead of style, but I say you can have both. You just have to really go out there um, and search for it. And for your everyday work bag, you generally will want something in a neutral color like a brown or a um, or a black. Usually the black is probably the, the best option. It'll go with a lot of different things. So but when you go out to cocktails with your friends or you go out to dinner, you don't necessarily want to have this big work purse that you take with you. You want something special. So the other purse that every woman needs in her accessory wardrobe is going to be something that's called a clutch purse or a small clutch. This is um, an example here of a gorgeous one. Um, so you want to have this small one um, that basically is going to fit just like your keys, your cell phone, and maybe a lipstick or something in there in your ID. Um, but it's very small, very stylish, and will make you look very chic when you go out with it. Um, so these are the two that you, at the bare minimum, need to have in your purse wardrobe. So on your handout, the two items that you should have written down under the purse section are something that I call the work purse. Other people might refer to it as an everyday purse. And the second one is going to be a small clutch. So when you're shopping for this online or you're going to the mall to shop for it, you would just tell the salesperson, I'm looking for a small clutch. And they would know exactly what you're talking about. So if you do have those two items in your wardrobe, then congratulations. You just earned your final accessory merit badge, which is the purse. Again, thank you so much for listening to the whole series. If you missed out on a video, just go online and check it out so you can catch up on the ones that you missed out on. Um, again, thank you so much um, for listening. I hope that you enjoy the information that, um, that you heard here, and have a good day. Bye.